Hi, this is Munson from Munson Music, and we're going to talk about how you could strum through a song called by Eric Church called Sinners Like Me. And it's going to start on the F major chord, and if, if you know the, the bar F major, you actually do your first finger across the entire first fret. We'll talk about an easy way to do this in a moment. But then your second finger goes to the G string on the second fret, third finger on the A string on the third fret, and the pinky on the D string on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds an F major chord, and it sounds really, really happy. And, we're, and we're, we'll talk about where we're going to move this for key in a moment, actually. But, but that, that's called an F major, and it sounds really, really happy. But a lot of times, if you're just starting out and you want to avoid the bar chords, actually a good substitute for that is something called F major 7. And the way you play F major 7, first finger is going to go to the B string on the first fret, second finger is going to go to the G on the second fret, and third finger is going to go to the D string on the third fret. And if you strum just the D, G, B, and E, kind of the skinny four strings, that sounds like F major 7, and it sounds really, really happy. And then from the F major, we're going to go to a C major chord. And the way you play C major, first finger is going to actually stay on the B string first fret. Second finger is going to go to the D string on the second fret. And third finger on the A string on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a C major chord, and it sounds really, really happy. And then from the C major chord, we're going to be going to a G major chord. And the way you play G major, first finger is going to go to the A string on the second fret. Second finger is going to go low E on the third fret. And the third finger is going to go to the high E on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a G major chord and it sounds really, really happy. And actually on our intro, we're, 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 it's kind of a block chord thing where we do a big F, C major, G major, F major, C major, G major. There's a cool little lick that, that, that Eric's kind of throwing in on the D string where you do an open to second walk up on the D string and it almost does an arpeggio of the F chord where you go third fret on the D, second fret on the G, first fret on the B, but then we go second on the D, open G, and then first fret on the B string, and it's almost like a big G with it just a down and down. So it could be a really cool lick to kind of throw in is that O, oh, two, three, two, one, two, open one, G chord. But then when we get into the rest of our song, actually, we're going to be using a lot of those same chords. We've we got F major, C major, G major, C major, F major, C major, G major, G major, F major, C major, G major. But then in the verses, we're going to be going to an A minor chord. And when we play A minor, the first finger is going to go to the B string on the first fret. Second finger on the D string on the second fret, and third finger on the G string on the second fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds an A minor chord, and it sounds really, really sad. And the verse we got to the A minor, and then we go back to F, C, G, C, 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 C. And those are basically the, the only four chords that we're going to have through it is the, is the C, A minor, F, and G. The weird thing here is a lot of times to make a, a song like this more interesting, I like adding something called a strum pattern. And one of my favorite strum patterns for a 3-4 like this is down, down, up, down, up. So if we just try that a lot on, on our F chord, just kind of used to it, you know, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up. Our intro, we'd have kind of an F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, and just kind of some waiting C. So we try that through our verse. We got our F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, E minor down, down, up, down, E minor down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down. Until we kind of get to to our chorus part, and on our chorus part we'd have our F down up down C down down up down G down down up down G A minor down up down F down down up down C down down up down G down down up down C 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 down down up down. And then we kind of repeat that for our verse. 
verse and our chorus, and then we have a solo part that comes in where we have A minor down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, down. to our song. The weird thing is instead of starting on an F major chord, Eric Church is actually kind of starting on a G flat major chord. So we took this the C major and kind of put it on first fret, right? Actually let's call it F sharp. It's just more fun. Um, so so it, the, the F, if we put a capo on the first fret, now your F is really an F sharp major. Your C major is really a C sharp major. Your G major is really a G sharp major and your A minor would really be an A sharp minor. So we tried that from the intro. We have our F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, big G. Or if you're, you're kind of digging on that lick, you'd have that open two, three, two, one, three, oh, one, G. intro we got kind of the F down up down C down down up down G down down up down G down down up down F down down up down C down down up down G down down up down G down down up down then we got kind of the C C C and then we go into our verse part so we got our F down up down C down down up down G down down up down C down down up down F down down up down C down down up down G So we got our F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, come on down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, up. And then we'd be on our chorus part. So we got our F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down. So then we got our F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, come on down, down, up, down, F down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, up. And then we kind of repeat that. We got F down, up, down, C down, down, up, down, G down, down, up, down. Oh, actually, we got our bridge part. So on our bridge, we got F down and down. Oh. So on our bridge, we're kind of mixing up a lot of those things that we just talked about. So we got F down and down, C down, down and down, G down, down and down, G down, down and down. So we got our A minor down, up, down, G down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 down,
chorus tag on that last chorus, we got F down a down C down down a down G down down a down and then go to C. And then we kind of pick up on our chorus. So we got our F down a down C down down a down G down down a down 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 down